Hi guys, it's Mrs. Bradford. Today I'm going to be making an aquarium with you from just some household items that you hopefully have. <clears throat> and if you don't have these, you can use whatever you want. You can just use crayons. Just trying to make it fun for you. So first thing we're going to do is you're going to get a paper plate and cut the top of it off just like I did. And my paper plate is not all the way white, but it doesn't matter because we're just going to color it anyway. So any paper plate will do. Okay, and then you're going to take your crayons. I'm going to point the camera down. And you're just going to color the inside blue. Like for water, right? Water in the aquarium. If you're using a really dark blue crayon, you can also add some light blue into it to give the color a little bit of variation because sometimes in the ocean there's light, dark, depending on how deep the water is. Okay, so there's my dark blue. Now I'm going to color the middle a little bit of light blue so I get two different colors. And I'm just coloring the middle. You can color all the way around if you want. If you want to color these sides, that's fine up here. But we're just going to color the, the middle for you right now. I'm going to turn it this way so it looks like it's supposed to look. So there's my, my water, right? So that's, that's that for the blue. Now I want to make some seaweed come up the middle. And I am going to draw just a big, long piece of seaweed, right? And I can take my crayon and color that in. Or I can use some glue and a glue stick and use some of my household items that I found to make it a little more fun, a little more uh, stick out of it. So I'm going to just add a bunch of glue to my seaweed here. It's just, just, just a regular old glue stick. There we go. Okay. And what I'm going to use on mine is this candy. Um, decoration stuff. Um, it's just colored sugar is all it is, but I'm going to use that and uh, I'm just going to sprinkle it on and it's a little bit messy mom so and dad so you might want to tray or something. I'm just going to shake it around then I need to dump it. I'll be right back. <coughs> dump the excess garbage. The seaweed looks more like a cactus but that's okay. You can make your seaweed look however you want right okay so then what I'm going to use for my for my uh, sand at the bottom of the ocean is I just took a graham cracker and I squished it all up and made it look like sand so I'm going to draw some put some glue at the bottom and sand sometimes it's straight across sometimes there's hills in it just whatever so again this is your artwork and you make it however you want it to be no right or wrongs should have brought a bowl over here. Okay, so we're just going to sprinkle on the graham cracker, shake it around. If you don't have graham crackers and you don't, or you don't want to do it like this, just use crayons and color it or markers. Totally fine. It's your artwork, right? Now I'm going to put the excess back into my little bowl. We're not going to eat these now because they're dirty, right? <laughs> so there I've got sand. I've got a piece of seaweed. And what I want to do next is add maybe some shells. And I have some pasta that looks like little shells. See? So I am going to glue some of these onto the bottom. Now, sometimes for these, you need to use liquid glue. But I just have a glue stick with me today. I, I think I used all my liquid glue. But I'm going to put a few little shells on top of the sand just here and there. And, um, ooh. My glue stick's getting graham cracker crumbs on it. <laughs> so I just put some little blobs of, of glue stick and I'm going to glue on to the, the side that's solid because these are shells that open up, but I want it on the side that's solid so it'll stick to my plate, right? Okay, so we're going to put the shells on. Look at that. And you can color it. You can actually color your shells with a marker if ever you wanted to do that. I would color them before I stick them on if you do that, but um, depends on how long you want to work on your project. Make it yours. Okay, so there we got sand, seaweed, and shells. What do we need? We need some fish. So look what I got. Goldfish crackers. <laughs> and I am going to 
really cool when you have the colored ones, all the different multicolors, but this is what I have today. So we are going to get some of our goldfish crackers out, and I'm going to glue my fishies on. I see. I'm going to do three fish. Okay. So I'm going to have a fish right here. Whoops. It's a lot of glue for a little fish. I'm going to glue one right there. And there you glue. There. If you're using a glue stick, again, use a big blob because uh, heavier items will need more glue. Look at that. Let's put one down here. It's closer to the bottom. Right? And we'll face him this way. What do you think? There you have it. That is our fish aquarium made with all kinds of stuff from around the house. But again, you can just use crayons and draw it too if you want. But uh, it makes it kind of fun when you can add some things that stick out. Anyways, hope you had a good time. Hope you like it. I can't wait to see yours. Bye!